of shuffling of the cards if you're ready. I've shuffled. I want to speak a little bit about yeah. November as yes. you're we're in the temple getting ready and uh, <laughs> we're going to talk about gratitude. <laughs> gratitude, right? Gratitude. This yes. is the month for gratitude. So we're going to put some gratitude on these cards. The white light of gratitude. Okay, are you ready? Ready. Okay, hey, that's the one is the card. I am the card, card person turner. today. Yep. She's cutting the cards. I'm cutting in front of you right here in the, in, temple. The moment, in the temple in the moment and here we go. <gasps> oh nice okay well yes. I like that card we have the three of wands in the upright in the position of the overall environment coloring the energy of the month of November right good card so you launch you launch you see the last month was about Finding your, um, what would you call it, your purpose? Yeah, and getting away from all the, we yeah. had said wishy-washy, but just wishy -washy, a little bit, you, all, you know, know. Grounding some of your ideas in reality and in the real world. Mm -hmm. And this is about that. This is about taking your inspiration and actually pushing it out there into the future. The gentleman is standing on a hill he's looking at the ships he's a merchant mm -hmm. and he's looking at the ships that are taking his goods to another shore he doesn't know if they'll reach that shore or not but he has great hope and he's full of um, enthusiasm for the prospect of what all this will mean for him, financially and otherwise, in the future. It's a very futuristic card. It's a very futuristic You're looking yeah. out into the future. Mm -hmm. And you've already done some work here. And you've put it out there. You've sort of given it out to the world. Yep. And you don't know where that's going to take you. Mm -hmm. But... It, the deed is accomplished. And interestingly enough, the four would be, interestingly enough, you know, about creating structure right. and arriving. Yeah. And arriving. Back right. to that nine of cups last month, which is getting everything that you want. Getting everything that you want. And yeah. let's see what is in your position of challenge. Oh, interesting. Oh. So, we have the Four of Cups, I'm not feeling it this month, I'm checked out, I'm having a hard time getting engaged, joining the party, feeling the joy, want the offer. Interesting, interesting, interesting. On the heels of the um, last month, you know? Yeah, it's interesting because I just uh, had a reading where this card came up, a private reading. And it was a question about motivation. What was the motivating factor in, mm. in, in say, a separation? Mm -hmm. And uh, the motivating factor, when you see this card, is a, a complete kind of, what's the word, um, being jaded. Yeah, jaded, yeah. When one is jaded, uh -huh. when the normal, like, you can't be stimulated by beautiful things anymore, like the simple things in life. Mm -hmm. And... It's not enough. It's not enough. So it, it, it's, uh, they say the card of apathy and boredom and... Mm -hmm. Boredom. Boredom. Mm -hmm. So what do, what do I do with myself? Mm -hmm. You know, wh what, what now? Where am I going? What am I, what is it all about? So you you've apparently launched something, mm -hmm. but there's a it's the 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 three of wands is a card of waiting. Yep. Waiting for the results. Yep. And in that process, you have to deal with yourself. Who mm -hmm. you are, what what you really want, what what is it that will make you feel content? Is it that something that's being offered you, what you want mm -hmm. or not? And so it's this whole idea of dealing with your own discontent. And going back to that Nine of Cups from last month, which is getting what you want. Your challenge is getting what you want. This is kind of the same thing. Yeah, it's, it's the it's same thing. It's still being offered to you. It's, you know, you, 
the opportunity is there, but do you want it? Do you want it? Mm -hmm. What do you want? Yeah. And who are you anyway? Is this... <laughs> You have no idea. <laughs> know thyself. <laughs> know thyself. You don't know who you are. Yeah. That's... How do you expect anybody else to know who you are? Let's go back to know thyself. Okay, so, let's get a better card here, why don't we, in the position of the unexpected. Come on, Ava. Okay, there we just spoke of that card. Isn't that interesting? We just mentioned it. Yeah. We're it's... not cheating over here. This is not cheating. It's the Four of Wands. Yeah. Which speaks to... Arrival. Arrival, yes. But not only arrival, but it's like putting down sticks, you know? It's yeah. like you, when you're, what, a, you know, you're a traveling gypsy. Yes. <laughs> and you decide at some point, unexpectedly, that you're going to put down stakes right. and um, you're going to create a structure. A strip. Yep. Or even a home. Um, but it's, it's, uh, it's idyllic because mm -hmm. you see the laurel wreath again, always some sort of victory. Mm -hmm. so you you're victor you feel victorious in some way, and you're being welcomed through these gates. So the opportunity is there. It is. You and can arrive. You if can arrive. You this project is whatever this was arrives mm -hmm. unexpectedly, and so because you had to wait, mm -hmm. deal with your own sense of boredom and figuring out what it is that's bothering you. Yeah. Uh, it comes to pass. It comes to pass. Yes. Next card. Here we go. Let's find out what it is. Oh, there you go. We are getting a little movement of love here. Could also be you as mediator if this is uh, peacemaker. If this is a, a job reading, you career become, reading. You become a lover. Yep. You do. And in not only the physical sense, but in the creative and spiritual sense. Yep. You display um, deep emotional sympathy and compassion for others. You know, this reading to me points to overcoming last month and even this Four of Cups. Mm -hmm. Like there's a certain amount, there's movement forward, mm -hmm. okay, because we see this three and then we have this four, mm -hmm. okay? Mm -hmm. So that is actually um, solid, okay? Because yeah. last month we had that sort of visioning, fantasizing yeah. card. Now we're creating structure. Structure. Through imagination and creative, spontaneous insight and, and, and joy of creation. And effort and, and patience. Effort. And doing it. There's patience involved yeah, patience. in that. Um, and sort of a doing it over and over kind of thing. And then at the very end, we've got this Knight of Cups, which is in opposition really to that four. Yeah, so instead of being bored, you become um, emotionally enlivened. You um, take that creative project forward. You are still in the sort of kind of middle phase mm -hmm. of something, mm -hmm. whether that's an, a relationship or a project or an artistic effort, mm -hmm. but you're in the middle, but you 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 move steadily ahead. Right. If you're looking for a new job, it might be kind of boring. That might be your challenge. Oh, I see. Like you kind of lose interest along the way, and then unexpectedly something takes shape, okay? Yeah. So you're starting to see, you're starting to feel like you would be more comfortable there and mm -hmm. welcome. Mm -hmm. And at the very end, you're ready to move forward. And if you're looking for love. Yeah, and if you're looking for love, there's a challenge there, there's though. The, there's the knight on the, on, on the, the knight in shining armor. Yeah, well, the challenge is going to be, you know, you're not sure if you'll want it for, yeah. you know, at the beginning of the month. Right, you're not sure in the beginning, but you take that cup at the end. Yeah, at the because end. Because look how he leads with his cup. Uh huh. So he leads with his inspiration. Mm -hmm. It's the heart that leads here. Yeah. Well, this is interesting to me because it's it's kind of like this, you know, the stance that we do that sometimes. Yeah. Because we're guarding our heart. Yeah. And we guard the solar plexus too, so that we are guarding the the that that which is um, our um, will. You mm -hmm. know that that okay. I'm gonna keep to myself. And yeah. I'm gonna protect myself from whatever it is that I feel is uh, encroaching upon. But that's some real body language that yeah. Capricorn might want to watch out for yeah. this month. Like if you're doing a lot if of this. If you do this, go like that. You open your heart. 
Yeah. Yeah. Open your heart. It's the only way you're going to get to that. Mm -hmm. Which looks like that's where you want to oh, be. Oh, there you go. Isn't it's a that nice beautiful? reading. Okay, so we need to talk about the fifth card. All right. Forget, because you don't have any majors. No. No major arcana tarot cards here that I can see. No. You turn over this fifth card. I would highly recommend it for you, Capricorn, so that you can get some higher spiritual counsel. Mm -hmm. um, a, a more meditative interpretation for this four card spread. Mm -hmm. I think you'll really be pleased with that. We've got these cards that we have designed for you, um, many of you, who um, prefer them to private and personal reading. Yes, yes some people do. Yeah. And uh, they are, I don't know, we've, got, we've had a lot of comments and a lot of new subscribers. So go ahead and do that. Also, um, if you'd like a private and personal reading, and we're, we're available for those. Just... Uh, Go to our website, which is avatrudivirtualtarot.com. I think there's a link for it, right? Yes, there is. Underneath us. Mm -hmm. And uh, you'll see the purchase a reading page, just in, in the panoply of things that you can choose from. And there, choose the one that's appropriate for your concern. And then uh, we will respond to you immediately. And start a gratitude journal. We hadn't spoken That's of that, true. but instead of... It's the month of gratitude. Yeah, this is the month of gratitude. Gratitude will light up your cerebellum the same way Prozac does. Right? Yes, it will. Okay. Yes, it will. So we highly recommend that. And we... there are no side effects. No. No. <laughs> Other than... Writer's crap. Happiness. Right. <laughs> and writer's crap. So thanks a lot for joining us. Thank you. And we will see you in the month of December. Thank you, Kevin. Namaste. Namaste.